Hello friends, Marcy here, and I'm excited to reveal day number 13 of 25 days on the Ink Bank calendar for December of 2023. And here we are, right here. Um, easy to find. So 13 puts us just past the halfway point. I'm excited about that. Um, this looks like a nice neutral color, and it's called Weeping Willow. Let me unwrap this plastic and I'll be right back. So Weeping Willow, let me zoom in a little bit. Looks like a standard ink. Okay. i not sure what this looks like yet. Anxious to get into that bottle. Um, I gotta get my stamp prepared. We don't need to shake that up because um, it won't have any shimmer to mix around but let's get a nib stamp on here and what will we find with a good swatch of ink. I'm imagining um, something between a taupe and an olive. That's what I'm imagining. Let's see what we get. Ooh, look at me. Something between a taupe and an olive. I love this. <laughs> kind of makes me think of Robert Oster's um, Muddy Bucket. course I'm expecting maybe something a little bit as it dries maybe we'll find some shading on there and get something you know since it's a standard ink and we don't need any uh, shimmers or shading wide lines let me go ahead and use the writing nib the kakamori writing nib so weeping oops i'm out of focus hold on Weeping Willow. Two thousand twenty three day thirteen die mine like this ink vent so before i open the bottle i was wondering if it would be a good matchy matchy ink for my um kaweco macchiato Ooh. botanical gardens that would look fabulous two Okay, so let's take a closer look at the Weeping Willow. And as it's drying, it's not quite dry, but as it's drying, um, I do see a defined um, border that gets darker. Right on the edge, there's a darker green that does look like olive. No, no shimmer, no sheen, just a gorgeous standard color that I'm enjoying very much. So thank you for joining me, spending your precious moments with me. You have a blessed day. Bye-bye.